Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the Big John TV. Got another awesome foreign food Friday for you today. We are, this is the last of our mm -hmm. Japanese snack box that we got. Yes, it was a huge box and we're finally getting through the last few items. It's been, well, last item. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not a few, it's a big pile. A lot of really good stuff in this box, so thank you so much. Thank Again, you, Mayu. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So without further ado, let's get working through this pile. We're gonna start here. Jess has the legend again. She's gonna read yep. what it is. This one is kabocha. Kabocha? Choco. Pumpkin in Japanese. It's pumpkin chocolate. It's real pumpkin powder used in the recipe. For you. So, it says pumpkin. I Ma still need one. Maddie didn't get one. Looks like squash. Thank you. Again, the spaghetti squashies. Ooh. Whoa. <clears throat> Are they hard candy or a chew? Mm -mm, it's chocolate. Oh, cool, cool, cool. It's pumpkin flavored chocolate. Oh, okay, look at that little get cube. Get it open. Little cube. Mmm, try it. It's How good. How's you to get it open before me? That proves on how weak I am. Mm. <laughs> These have a good Ooh, flavor. That's really good. It's good. The mm. pumpkin flavor is not overpowering. It's like a very subtle sweetness. Very mild, like pumpkin spice flavor, kind of. No pumpkin spice. No. Just squash. I don't, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't taste the pumpkin spice. Well, good. Finish it. You like it? It just tastes like chocolate. It's good, huh? Mhm. Mm cool. That's mm -hmm. a winner. Those were delicious. Even All right. Amy likes it so we're gonna we're gonna move quick. Next. Number two. Number two. Levain crackers, banana yogurt flavored. Ooh. They have lactic acid bacteria. Ten billion per bag. So it's like Whoa. um. Like regular dry yogurt type stuff, or liquid yogurt. What? Whatever, you know what I'm talking about. I'm sorry, what? The probiotics in yogurt, that's right. what it's got. So they look like little Ritz crackers, little mini ones. Uh, pass them one down, pass them down. Pass Whoa. them down. I like that you put your nose to it before you pass it to your mother. So it little, smells like banana. It smells like straight up banana yogurt. It's got that little bit of a of a, of a twang to it. Ready? I'm not fond of bananas. It's good. Mm -hmm. it's it good. tastes like banana. Yeah, straight up. I don't know. But you get a little bit of salty from that cracker too. That's not bad. Those are good. That almost reminds me of like a banana pudding. Yeah. When you got the cookies good. on top and yeah. stuff. That's Jamie, it is good. actually pretty good. You'd like it. All right, that's a good one. Yeah, the those are interesting. Crackers. Good one. Cool, cool, cool. All right, number the 23, 23. 23. Oh, Take Noko no Sato. Bamboo shoots. Pumpkin cheese taste. Ooh. All right. Cute shaped chocolate with cookie. Pumpkin cheese taste flavor. Little, these are cool shapes. These are so cute. They look oh. like. They look like little acorn. No, they look like bamboo shoots, duh. No, they look like. Well, duh. They look like a um, heel. Yeah, like a mountain. Yeah. But yeah, this is what a bamboo shoot looks like. All right, here we go. I'm using that as an ice cream. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Strange. Just tastes like like a uh, cookie. There's nothing weird in there at all. That's a good one too. That's good. Yeah. Very mild flavor. I get the squash flavor. I don't. Mm -hmm. Towards really. the end, a little bit. Mm -hmm. I Take like that. Bite. Eat the whole thing. It's good. <clears throat> That's good. I can't eat it. Come on. I like that it's not super sweet. I'm not like squash. It I'm glad you tried like a little bit. To me. What about the banana? Do we need to go back to the banana one yet and try it? It's a good one. The it banana is. cracker. Yeah, the banana cracker was surprisingly good. All right, and number, I don't even like banana. <clears throat> number eight. Eight. Eight is Fujiya. Fujiya home pie. Yep, bitter chocolate flavored pie oh. pastry with bitter chocolate. So that's like dark chocolate. <clears throat> All right, let's get this open. Cool. Smells like chocolate. Oh, those are cute. Uh, look at the bottom. Ooh, that's a lot of chocolateiness, isn't it? it? Smells like good dark chocolate. All right. So little tiny cookie squares. Mm -hmm. I took a bite. Drizzle it on top, coat it on the bottom. Can I try what it? What it tastes like? What? I mean, just like um, um, toasted. I mean, um. Think about it. 
To me, the, the bread part, or the pastry part, tastes just like a toast. Yeah, like bread. it tastes like, um, really, um, hot toast that, mm -hmm. um, is really burnt. Mm -hmm. Yeah, toast. a little bit. Really good chocolate flavor. Those are good. Those and are again, excellent. not super sweet. Right. Okay, um, number seven? You want to do seven, or do you want to do number 14? Let's do seven. Okay, seven. Seven is rich okay. chocolate sandwich. They don't have the chocolate covered, so this is what they have instead. Right. So it's sandwich cookies, sandwich crackers. Um, yeah, we can get the, the chocolate covered ones here, but... Can you help? Nope. <laughs> I can bang that with my face. All right, so two oh. little sleeves inside the box. I like that. Here you go. Okay. It was like those Oreos you tried on the go. Mm-hmm. All right. Stack of Ritz crackers. One for you. I like Ritz crackers. I love Ritz crackers. So just the double with the chocolate uh, chocolate cream in the middle. Mm, that's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The sweet salty mm -hmm. combination there is so killer. Yep. Yep. Those are good. You get that salty, buttery, rich. I get just a big thumbs up. Big, you like this <laughs> one too, huh? All right, well, so far Jamie's doing pretty good in this pile. But yeah, you get that salty, rich, buttery, and then the mm -hmm. bang, chocolate. Good. That one is excellent. 14? 14 is... Fran. Hold on. Fran, double chocolate, with chocolate with cookie sticks. Okay, cookie sticks, so it's kind of like... Kind of like Pocky. Pocky. It got crummy, huh? Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> Aren't those fancy? Mom and Jamie, share? Sure. You take or, a bite. Or hey, you know what? You finish it. I'll share with Mom. You can finish that one because I know you'll like it. Yeah, that's a good one. So, cookie stick? Mm-hmm. Coated in chocolate? With chocolate. I don't and know why. It's a chocolate that, cookie. I don't know why that would be anything but great. Bat. It does look like a baseball bat. <laughs> you can finish it. That's excellent. Pretty straightforward. I mean, chocolate. Yeah. Oh, it's cookie. a good flavored chocolate. Mm -hmm. Oh, like a chocolate lightsaber? That's pretty funny. <laughs> All right, so that I was like that one. one. Boom. All right, next, let's do number three. Number three, angel pie, strawberry, creamy marshmallow and chocolate covered cake sandwich. I'll save the rest of that for later. Well, these are individually wrapped. Nice. Let's, open, let's open two and see if we can share, you think? Okay. Okay. So, so the box, there you go. Chocolate, white chocolate covered looking strawberries. Oh, and it's so cute. Whoa. So take a bite and then I'll take a bite. Look at They're that. Cool yeah. They remind me of moon pies, but smaller. I think it looks like a, um, Oh, wow. man. Mm-hmm. I'll take a bite. Okay. Good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That is very strawberry flavored. That is pretty much... Finish it. Finish it. I can't. It's pretty mm -hmm. much like, uh... A moon pie. Moon pie, just like you said. A little bit of marshmallow in the middle. Really good strawberry mm -hmm. flavor. Yeah, that tastes like a chocolate dipped <clears throat> strawberry. Yeah. That was excellent. Yep, cool. Another good one. That's a really good one, actually. I like Man, that. Yeah, there's been some good stuff in this one. Yeah, everything's been good. All right. Since this is on top, when we're talking about moon pies, how about moonlight? Number 21 on your 21. legend. 21. Moonlight soft cake. <clears throat> Famous <clears throat> cookie called moonlight. Now we have moonlight cake. Eggy soft cakes with vanilla cream. So I think this is going to be extra like moon yep. pie. Except okay. these are not chocolate coated. Okay. Whereas a moon pie would be, right? Ooh, you like that strawberry one? So they, they are nice and soft. What are these called? Uh, whoopie pies? Is it oh, yeah, kind of like a whoopie pie. It's like cake. Cookies with frosting in the middle. Are you still chewing on the other one? Then I'll take the first bite. Mmm. Those are excellent, too. Although, after having that rich <clears throat> chocolate, these are a little bit, like, weak. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, it's almost like a, um, almost like just a regular sponge cake, like Twinkie. Yeah, that's true. Not quite as sweet. The filling inside, to me, almost has no flavor. Mm -hmm. 
they chew really nice. They're good and soft. Very soft. So, there we go. Those are pretty good. Mm-hmm. Moonlight. Nice. Those are good. Got a whole bunch of little bites left over here, huh? I know. All right, so this one will be a good one. These are custard cakes. This is number four. Number four. It's been around a long time. It's maybe the Japanese version of a ding dong, she says. Oh, okay. Well, ding dongs are chocolate covered, though. Right. So, like, it's similar because it's got a creamy filling. Oh, it's spongy. Very it's soft. Spongy. Feel it. Custard yeah. cakes. It feels funny through the package, huh? Yeah. The idea. Let's. Okay, now let's feel it. Why are you feeling the food? I'm gonna okay, bite. So she said, ding dong. She said ding dong. Did, but maybe she meant Twinkie. Maybe she meant Twinkie. Because right off the bat, that golden sponge cake, that's what it, I mean, it looks like it, smells like it. Oh, yeah. That's good. That is delicious. It's got a super soft, spongy texture. Mm -hmm. Like, Twinkies are kind of chewy and yeah. almost rubbery, but this has, it's so delicate. Yeah. It's very airy, mm -hmm. very light. Great custard flavor in the middle, too. I dig that. That's mm -hmm. a good one. Cool. Another good one. All right, let's do Jamie's and then we'll do these okay. last. Okay. Show them what you got, Jill. Jamie, tell them. Um, this is Cocoa. But hold, crisp. Hold it up hold so it they up, can see it because it's got a really cool this face on it. This is crisp cocoa chocolate up. corn flakes covered. Dang it. What? That's what it says. Chocolate corn, chocolate covered corn flakes. There cool. we go. So Rice Krispie okay. treat, but just yeah. a different kind of cereal. Mm, I don't think it's got marshmallows. I think it's just chocolate and crisp uh, okay. corn flakes. Okay. Jamie really wanted to do this the first, but we. Made him okay. laugh, made that one close to last so he stayed the whole time. <laughs> yeah, You're off like camera. Big. You're off camera. Scoot this way. Scoot over, man. Alright, there you go. Pull this one. Let's turn it. So Whoa. it's got a little tray in Plastic there. Plastic tray. Whoa. Cool. That looks cool. You could take I think I might want to keep that tray. Yeah, you could use a little bit bundles. So it tears apart like a Almost like a granola bar at this point. Yeah, yeah, it's closer to a granola bar than a Rice Krispie treat. Mm. Oh man. Mm, yeah, so that's, that's literally like cornflakes covered in chocolate. Mm -hmm. It's a half moon. Mm hmm. They're they're lighter and airier than a Rice Krispie treat. Right. They're not as gluey. Mm -hmm. They want to break apart a little bit easier. But they chew great. Good chocolate flavor. Yeah, that. And it's interesting because the texture of the cereal part <clears throat> to me reminds me of com somewhere between a Rice Krispie and a Corn Flake. Yeah. It's like a flattened Rice Krispie. Yeah. Mm. Those are great. Yeah. Another another good one. All right. Now we're completely changing direction. <laughs> we are officially done with everything. We've got one item left. She'd put this one in there. Was it when she say on it? This was number 22. 22. This one is uh, Kamita crisps. Wasabi. Everyone's favorite Kamita crisps. We have several flavors for this one. I chose wasabi for you, John. Thanks, Mayu. So, it just. I just, was eating it. You gotta try, try a little, little bit. bit. It's just a snack mix. Just a simple little cracker mix, right? But they I'm are. Wasabi flavor. No, I'm going to get Stop, stop, stop. stop. Jamie's going to try and sneak and eat that whole thing right now. <laughs> right. Stop, bud. Mm, these smell good. There's peanuts in there. There's little, um... Oh, smell good. spicy. Crap. No, it did not. You want it? I'll take the first bite if you don't trust it. They look I good. I love the little snack cracker mixes like these. Yeah. There's a few varieties we can get around here. Spicy. Ah, ah. Okay, it's not the spicy that uh, bothers me. The flavor of wasabi kills me. I, I can't handle it. Horseradish wasabi, not a flavor know, I dig. At first it was like, it was gonna like wham. But then it totally mellowed out. And then it's just that foam. It totally flavor. slowed down. 
And I like these. Do you? Yeah. I, I don't, I can't do the wasabi flavor. I'm just breaking all tiny pieces. It, it's, it's really not bad. It's really not that offensive. You get that mouthfeel that where it's like, <laughs> you know? Like you're breathing fire. Right, but it's really not bad. I could dig that. Those are good. So you eat the peanuts by themselves. Give me peanuts. They're pretty. They're pretty mild. It's these little crackers that are that are gonna get you. As soon as they hit your tongue, it's like just a little bit. <laughs> get that burn. That little little. But then it goes away. Yeah. I dig them. Good I know stuff. other people really enjoy the wasabi flavor and horseradish it, and all it, that family. It, of it literally. It literally tingles on your tongue. Yeah. Like I can feel it so where it's at. You know how you feel about cilantro? Yeah. That's how I feel about wasabi. Mm. I just can't, I can't do it. The mm -hmm. flavor is gross to me. And I wish I liked it. Eat the crackers too. Balance it out with the peanut at the same time. You want to try one? No. They're not right. spicy. They just have a spice to them. A little bit of a burn. Uh -huh. Like that. <laughs> It but it's tongue. got a good. It does zing your tongue, right? And then it goes away, pretty quick. Yep. Yeah. All right. What was your favorite <clears throat> out of everything, Jim? Uh, oh, can I take a wild guess? Can I do it? Can you tell that? Me? This, yeah. Yeah, the chocolate. Off camera. The crisp choco. Off camera. Oh, and the moon one. The moon the one. The moon ones. The custard cakes. The Ritz crackers. And. The, the strawberry thing, the marshmallow the thing. Yeah. These, this was a delicious pile of snacks. I'm really Thank impressed you. with the flavors of the chocolate coming out of yeah. Japan. They're chocolate, excellent. Chocolate flavored things are amazing. I thought we had some good flavor of chocolate in California, but yep. we had some good stuff. <laughs> All right, guys. Once again, if you're interested in sending us some goodies, be it funky, be it normal, be it foreign, whatever, just something your that's your favorite right. that you think we haven't tried before. We, you really want us to eat it on camera? We will. There's a peel yeah. box down below. Um, we'll post it in there. It's always in there, but we'll be more than happy to do that for you. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit the like button if you're in, if you enjoy these kind of videos. Every Friday we try and do either funky or foreign, something different, something yep. abnormal, something that takes us out of our norm, out of our realm, gets the kids to try some new things, be a little bit adventurous with food, which I think is important. And this is a really great way to do it. And you guys get involved and send us stuff, it makes it even easier. So we're getting real true, authentic stuff. Yep. Right? Exactly. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one. Bye. See you.